Congratulations to our incoming president, Ryan Becker, and to all of those who put their names forward for our board in a spirit of servant leadership, uh, to, and to all of our constituency association boards, thank you for being there for Alberta. Ryan, Ryan Becker, our, our new president, comes from one of my favorite places, a little hamlet in our, our far north called La Crete. <laughs> Go La Crete. It is the most northerly farm community in the world, a place that in so many ways represents the spirit of Alberta. The Cree and Dene peoples overcame the rugged elements to build communities in that region for millennia, traveling the mighty Peace River to trade with other tribes as our first entrepreneurs. In fact, the name of the Peace River comes from a treaty that ended years of warfare between them. Les premières communautés européennes autour de la Crète ont été fondées par les Canadiens français, y compris les missionnaires au Blatt. And since the 1930s, La Crete has been a refuge and a new beginning for Mennonite families from the, around the world, often fleeing persecution to seek religious freedom and opportunity as frontier people in the newest part of the new world. It's a remarkable story, and those families continue to clear and plow virgin soil like the prairie pioneers of over a century ago. They are tough people, driven by a relentless work ethic, many working to harvest uh, lumber in the cold northern winter, farming in the summer, and taking oil field jobs on the side. They have built a compassionate, resilient community where people take care of one another in times of need, just as they did this past summer, opening their homes to indigenous evacuees from the northern wildfires. The Rempel boys from the great country group High Valley sing these words about their hometown, La Crete, in their song, Come On Down. They say, our arms are always open, sawmills, farms, and refineries. Yeah, that looks like home to me. Out here in the country, out here in the country, we leave the light on for you and we never lock the door. Just come on down to the land of milk and honey. That's the Alberta spirit. That is the Alberta spirit looking at a cold, remote, northern farming hamlet where everything has been drawn by blood, sweat and tears and seeing it as the land of milk and honey. You know, most Albertans today will never experience the frontier life of La Crete, but we, but we know that those solid values run deep in our province and in our people. It's who we are. That's why Alberta's motto is Fortis a Liber, strong and free. Newcomers, that's right. Newcomers who join us from around the world choose to start new lives in Alberta for freedom and opportunity, not for government handouts. Like the Mennonites of La Crete, immigrants from every corner of the world bring with them a deep work ethic, a devotion to family, a sense of personal responsibility, and a zeal for the creative power of enterprise. They may not clear new land, all of these newcomers to our province, but they often work two or three survival jobs just to save up, educate their kids, start a new business, and find ways to give back to those in need. Folks, our mission is to renew Alberta as that special place of opportunity, of strength, and of freedom. 